Joao Pinto, Figo again. Rui Costa, Figo, and Elder. Rui Costa. It's Kelly who saves the day. Paulinho Santos. And it was a foul by Ray Houghton. It was a silly free kick in that area. The ball was going dead anyway. It was going to be a throw in. Instead of that, we've got to defend against a free kick. Always more difficult. Paulinho Santos. Figo. Turning Sheridan. Still it's Figo. Bringing in Rui Costa. And up the body of Ray Houghton for a corner. The feet of Rui Costa. Sheridan is able to clear. Irwin, there's just John Aldridge up front. But he's a willing runner. And that's over the top of Joao Pinto. Oh, and he's played it in. And Matt Quinn might get there. And Quinn has got there. Oh, what a misspeaking Unbelievably bad defending by the Portuguese. And you back him to put one of those away every time. John Aldridge did tremendously well here. And while he was running forward and harassing and breaking him down, Niall King Quinn covered a lot of ground. He came in here, he won the tackle. From there, I thought he was going to score, and that would have been game, set, and match. But we've still got a big game on. Figo. Or Elder, who's left his defensive post. Domingos. Elder running on with Kelly. And pushing Kelly over. Free kick to Ireland. I think a feature of this game so far has been the performance of Gary Kelly. Without doubt, up to the present moment, he's been the best Irish player. He's the, probably one of the few Irish players that can match them for pace, the Portuguese for pace, and ma not, not only match them, at times he's outrunning Tremendous exhibition of fullback play tonight from him. Quinn against Fernando Couto. Oh, beautifully done. It's Houghton now. Too many red shirts in the middle. But what a wonderful back heel by Niall Quinn, who's shown touches in the air and touches in the ground. It's been another sterling show. But here's Figo for Portugal, taken off his toe by Townsend. And João Pinto's pass too firm. Take us back to that, Ray. This Niall Quinn, I'm sure, will hold this one now because it was superb skill. He held him off, he was big enough, strong enough. He, held, he saw what happened, and that was some touch by any, by any standards. Unfortunately, you can see there, John Sheridan was clear. Ray Houghton picked the wrong option. Again, another chance we could put this game away. It could be, we could be out of sight by now. Rui Costa. Joao Pinto. Rui Costa. And the shot well saved by Kelly. That was a good stop. Rui Costa will take the corner. And it's a short one for Figo. The angle for the cross. It's off Quinn's head and off Bab's head. Fernando Couto going after it. Bab makes the challenge, the steward says it's Ireland's ball, but the linesman doesn't agree. <laughs> McGrath. And then away by Irwin. Paulo Souza. Unable to keep it in. That's relieved a little bit of pressure that they've had on us there. It was a hell of a good shot here, and, and be under no illusions, this was a good stop from Kelly. That ball was going to be very close. Alan Kelly's done well for us tonight. And that's come straight to Niall Quinn. Couto doing well. Domingos. Rui Costa. Back to take it from him was Townsend. Quinn clearing. But only as far as Paulinho Santos, who's lost it to Aldridge. Rolled inside for Houghton. 
Aldridge makes the run up the line, and that's for him. Beautiful ball to Ray Houghton. Sheridan wants it inside. That's where it's gone. And off for Houghton, who's onside. And Bailly is at him, he's going to save. Oh, remarkable play by Ireland. That really was. Houghton timed his run superbly. Beat the offside trap. And it took the goalkeeper, sprinted from his line to save. There's no foul here. It's quick. Got the sensible thing, trying to chip him. Had a much better second half. It was a fabulous passage of play because leading up to that, Niall Quinn won a ball in the right half position. He also won a ball right on the edge of his penalty area. Yet two seconds later, he's at the other end of the pitch and he's having a chip back goal. The play, the, the, the build up there between Houghton and between John Aldridge was first class. Figo. Folia. Laid off for Costa. Kelly lost his footing. Houghton's back to challenge. Kelly's there too, and Gary Kelly's offering a masterful display. Aldridge, beautiful control. Houghton, Quinn is offside, just about, just about. This, this is the build-up here. A good ball from John Sheridan, perfect time, and first touch, unfortunately, let Ray Houghton down there. Niall Quinn following up. Unlucky Niall Quinn, he was entitled to try that. He's had a great game. And some wonderful individual performances and what's been a marvellous team show too. Raul Pinto looking for Domingos inside McGrath. Domingos and it's Kelly to the rescue. Who is another star of this night. Another fine save. He didn't have a save to make in the first half, but he's done well twice at least here. A very good ball, made the forward favourite, even though Paul McGraw was tight. And he came, he spread himself, and he has done well. And he's had to earn his corn because this is a very, very good Portuguese side. Well, it was well saved by Kelly. Dangerous ball in, and Kelly, oh, such composure, such great composure again. Just killed the ball with his forehead, and saw it safely back to Alan Kelly. This is the best performance that I've seen from a fullback for many, many years at any level. In goes Aldridge, bravely to Houghton in the middle, Quinn's arriving now, here's John Aldridge still. His cross, Quinn's in! to fight belief wonderful again by John Aldridge measured the cross to perfection and somehow Niall Quinn beat the keeper he deceived him completely but put it wise when you consider that Niall Quinn was the guy who knocked the ball on to John Aldridge and made 20 30 yards at the end of it did everything right ball didn't go in oh he, he sold the keeper the dummy and everything it was quite quite remarkable it was the perfect cross too and now it's Fernando Couto. So what we have, we hold about the Irish performance now. And you can't argue with that, but it's Joao Pinto. Portugal will go to the very end. But the end they've gone out is not the end they intended to find themselves in. The goal kick. Well, he has put together a team that has fashioned one of the great performances. There's no doubt about that. By a street. The toughest opposition that the Irish team has met in this group. And after giving best to them for the first period of the match, they grew in confidence. They got their goal just before half-time, and that's been enough to seal the victory after a performance and a half by Jack Charlton's Ireland. Portuguese are a very young side, and they came here uh, and they worked really hard to so did it in front of us. But I don't think they really cause us too much problems, you know. Uh, we manage with them in the back, the midfield and up front. Niall and John were outstanding. They proved in the first 45 minutes that they're a good team. And uh, they always look capable of maybe carving a good chance out, you know. And when, once they turned past our midfield and started to run out of our defence, they did um, they, they look very capable of scoring a goal, yeah. They seemed to come through the middle a lot, so they did. And uh, a bit of speed up front, you know. So there was a few one-on-one -on -one dog races, really, you know. So, uh, but I thought we, we coped with them well. And, Get them a few kicks now and then, you know. I think they took the mick out of us the first 10 minutes, but once we got used to them and uh, we played the way we wanted to play, you know.